All right, so I'm going to be recalibrating the last transarchery HS3. Um, I noticed that the scale was off and excuse the background noise. I'm at work right now. It's the only area that I can actually get this set up. So first off, what you're going to need to do is figure out some way to set up a weight system that allows you to get to 44 pounds. That is how you calibrate it off of the 44 pounds. So either get plates, make sure that there are uh, the weight that they mentioned. I noticed that most of them run slightly less. So make sure that you do have them at the correct scale. Then once you do add that all up, make sure you have 44 pounds. And then what we're gonna do is walk through the process of setting this up. So excuse me, the lighting's kind of crappy, but what you're going to do is you have to have the battery out of the device. It's on the back here, just slides right in. So what you're going to do is you're going to have these two buttons here. You're going to push both these buttons simultaneously while you put the battery in. Then you're going to have, I'm trying to see if it's going to focus here. It's not going to focus too well, but you're going to have these numbers pop up push this again calculate and then you're ready so what you're gonna do is now set it up on a device that's gonna hold it like this so you're gonna have the scale down on the bottom that's free to be used and what I have here is I'll pop it up I have this rolling device and I'm gonna just put it right here and then hang the weights off the bottom so Got it set up now. Once it is set up, let me put it going here a little bit so I get better background noise. Um, once you have it set up with the weight on it, it's gonna be flashing the number. It's gonna be like 44.1 or something like that, um, right around 44 pounds. Once you get within the respectable range that it is stating on the screen, it's gonna say pass and then turn off. At that moment, you are done and complete. And uh, put the case back on, double check and verify that the weight is correct to the weight that you use. Once you get back on, basically just hook it back up, pull the weight off the ground so it's fully suspended, to double check, and it's right as rain. So now I'm good to go. I get to check my bows, make sure that everything's right. I was having issues with this reading low. So if you're having issues, with this um, scale saying that it is reading low or high or whatever you know that it's not the correct weight that you should be getting make sure you do recalibrate it it's super simple super super easy um, and it's always good to have this set up correctly so you know exactly where your bow is so you can get your bow tuned arrow spine correctly to that so hope that helped